Hi everyone, Happy New Year. Welcome to Auntie Anna Budget. I've been MIA, just kidding. I've been working really hard and still budgeting, but I was doing it off camera. Um, I have a lot of new stuff and let me start with my Christmas gift. My sons and my husband all pitched in and bought me a Gucci wallet. Oh my gosh, you should have seen my reaction when I opened this gift. It was like, oh my gosh. So this year, um, using this new wallet, thank you to my boys and my husband. Thank you guys. And my husband and I, um, to celebrate our 31st year anniversary, and he gave me this ring. He upgraded to a better ring, I want to say. I don't know. I love it. Thank you guys. Thank you. And I have a new planner. Um, I bought a new uh, planner from the um, <clears throat> Plum Paper. And I'm using Life and Envelopes stickers. I've used them um, for quite some time and I love her stickers. So, and I have some from... Um, last year that I'm still going to use them this year. So that's something new. My wallet and my bud budgeting planner. And like I said, I have a lot of um, budgeting stickers that I'm going to finish up and then start buying some more because I need to finish this. This is overflowing. I need to buy some more um what is this, an album to keep them in or to simply use them and then buy some more stickers because this is way too much. Look at this. Look at this. I have lots and lots of stickers, which I'm planning to use this year, finish them up, but I can't help it, guys. She makes such beautiful stickers. I can't help it. Okay, enough with the stickers and let's move on to... I also have, sorry, I also have a new, uh, um, what is this called? It's been so long, guys, I'm so sorry. I have a new binder. I put a Hello Kitty sticker on it, and I got new envelopes. They're still the same categories, but I got new binder, new envelopes, new binder, and starting new. They're all empty. I'm sorry that my fingers are blue. I just cleaned out all my trackers because I'm starting fresh this year. We're going to start with that. And then I also ordered, because I figured I needed a few more categories, but the shop that I ordered the other the other um, envelopes was closed. So I ordered these from a different shop. And she didn't offer um, the labeling option. So it's okay. I'll go ahead and... um put in something in there. I'm going to use one for holidays because I've noticed that for um, Halloween at work we do this Halloween contest. We buy our costumes and we have this thing going on. It's it's so much fun. So this year I want to be prepared for that. And um, for Thanksgiving I want to be able to have enough money so that I can host this year maybe and if not still pitch in and help for the Thanksgiving dinner. Okay, so that's that. And let's start setting up. So how's everyone? How's everyone doing? Hope everyone's been well. I've missed being here. Let me tell you the reason why I don't like recording is because I am not good at editing the videos. And I get overwhelmed. And my son used to help me with this. But he moved out. And I understand that. But... Um, yeah, so that's why I stopped recording. Oh, I also ordered um, placeholders. Hello Kitty placeholders. I don't know if they're showing up on camera. But yeah, I ordered quite a few. So I have these. And I also have the regular placeholders. And let's start with my wallet. Okay, so for my wallet, I get... Um, for spending, I get, oh, I don't know if I've shown these um, envelopes 
on YouTube. I don't know when was the last time I actually recorded or which envelopes I had at the time. But okay, for spending, I get $60. And I like using the long envelopes. I've seen that a lot of you have those um, Moterm wallets, I, say, I want to say they're called. They're beautiful. I love them. But what I don't like is getting a bill and it's creased and it's all weak. I don't like folding my bills. That's the only thing I don't like. I'm sorry for those that love those little tiny envelopes. I mean, they're beautiful and everything. I just have this thing about bills being folded and all wrinkly and old and yeah, sorry. So $60 for my spending. And I apologize if this video is a little off or I haven't done a video in a long time, so I'm sorry. Gas gets $100. 20, 40, 60, 80, 1. 10, 20, 40, 60, 80, 1. And this one is folded, so let's unfold it. So, $100 for gas. Even though gas prices are going down, I still want to budget with $100. Anything that um, I have left over, I could just roll it over. And groceries, we're still doing 200 1, 20, 40, 60, 80. It's 200. Actually, I think we do 250. I'm sorry, it's been a minute. Um, 40 and 50. Let's count this again. So it's 100, 20, 40, 60, 80, 220, 40, and 50. 250 dollars for groceries. And I don't know where you guys are at, but right here where I live, we're having problems finding eggs at the grocery stores. I don't know what's going on, but there's no eggs anywhere. We've gone to several <clears throat> grocery stores and we can't find them anywhere. We went to Costco and there was no eggs. That's weird. Very weird to me. Okay, so here we go. We're going to start with anniversary anniversary we're gonna go ahead and give um let's give it ten dollars start out with ten dollars i did not budget anything i did not plan for this i'm just gonna fill up the envelopes as we go birthdays we're gonna give it 20. so what are you guys' new year's resolution did you guys make any What's your plan for this year? Any budgeting goals that you have for this year? I decided that this year my one and only or major resolution would be self-care. Self-care because I've been letting myself go. Uh, my, anxiety, my anxiety is getting worse. I don't know if I've mentioned this before on camera, but I have anxiety driving and my work requires me to drive to the office and it's getting worse and I need to work to pay bills. So I'm gonna focus on me. I'm gonna just, before I can focus on anyone else, before I can help my family and my friends and cause I don't mind, I love helping my family and friends. But if I don't focus on me first, I won't be able to resolve that problem and be well enough to help my family and friends and whatever they might need me in. Okay, so car is gonna get 40. Oh, speaking of car, um, we just got my husband a brand new car for his birthday i almost said his age i don't know if he's going to be okay if i said his age i mean if we're celebrating 31 years together i'm pretty sure you can figure out how old we are but yeah new car expense uh christmas christmas i'm gonna go ahead and give it 20 this year 2022 that just passed i didn't have enough money in my envelope but what i did is i minimized my list 
because I would plan on giving people all but buy gifts for even family members that I don't see on a daily basis or I don't even see them on Christmas but because they're still family and because you know me being me I wanted to give them something even though we didn't see them or we're not going to see them until like mid-year um this year I was smart enough to put that aside I said told myself you know what stop spending stop swiping that card you're not going to do that this year. You're only going to budget for those people that you do see, those people that you do hang around with, and plan for those people, which is family and friends. And so I downsized my list, and I only spend within my means. Because the old me would want to buy expensive gifts and swipe my card, and at the end of the year... Starting the new year, I would have this huge debt. Well, no more. I downsized my list. I gave to those people that we were around with and only spent what I could. And everybody was happy. I was happy. I'm happy. They were happy. And that's the way to go. And I learned from my past mistakes. So, yes, I'm glad I did that. <clears throat> emergency an emergency we're gonna put two hundred dollars and friends we're gonna put twenty dollars house we're gonna put twenty dollars Medical is getting 10. Miscellaneous is getting 20. Self-care, because I want to start going to therapy and my insurance doesn't cover it, um, I'm going to start saving up for that, for those therapy sessions. And... Hopefully start therapy and soon. I don't know when, but soon. I'm going to go ahead and put $100 because each session is $175. That was the cheapest I found. And it's expensive. So I'm going to try to do things on my own that might help me overcome my anxiety of driving. And then figure out therapy because... It's expensive, guys. It's expensive. Travel. We want to travel this year. Uh, it's a milestone birthday for me this year. And my husband wants us to go to Hawaii. But I don't know if it's within the budget. So, I don't know. We'll see. We'll see how that turns out. Utilities. $200 for utilities. Uh, the one dollar challenge. Oh, yeah, I got a new envelope one dollar challenge gets one two three four five six dollars Six dollars into the one dollar challenge envelope The five dollar challenge gets One two wait, I'm supposed to put I need five for the five 10, 15, okay, so 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. We get 10 $5 bills, which is 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, not bad. $50 into the $5 challenge. I need to clear my trackers because I was um, using them. But now i got to clean these up. I didn't get to clean that up. Okay, for the 100 envelope challenge, I did designate $55 for that. So, oops, you know what? Maybe I did my math wrong. Well, let's do 25. I'll figure out where the other, the rest of the money is. I'm telling you, I'm so nervous. I'm, the good thing is that I picked up the phone and I'm doing it again. 
and this helps me relax, believe it or not. <clears throat> Budgeting with stickers and a nice planner, just sitting down, having time for myself. And putting money into designated envelopes, it's therapeutic for me. I mean, my videos are not the best. And again, I have issues with editing. But you know what? Who cares? I'm going to do what I can. And if this helps me relax, I'm going to go for it. So, with that said, Costco is getting nothing for right now. Uh, Dollar Tree is getting $5. I haven't been to Dollar Tree in a minute for a few months. I can't wait to go. So I got to build this up because now everything's $1.25. So got to build this up so I can go shop. Um, I'm going to start saving for future stickers, budgeting stickers. That's mainly what I buy in Etsy. I've bought a lot of Christmas gifts through Etsy and everybody loved it. I have, um, actually I have, two new nephews this um from 2022 and i got them both customized items from etsy and one of those nephews is from my brother this is his first child he has a son and i got a customized book oh my gosh they loved it it's etsy it's ama amazing guys totally recommend it for customized items or gifts beautiful very 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 nice Actually, these $10, I'll go ahead and put it in a $100 envelope because I do not know what I did. I'm missing some cash. I don't know where, where I put it, but I'll figure that out later. Well, that's it, guys. Thank you so much for watching my channel. Thank you so much for being here, and I'll see you guys in the next one. And I will be recording even if my videos are a little... Eh. Right? Happy New Year, and... Wishing you guys the best, and I'll see you guys here. Bye, guys.